Welcome back to Booze and Rocks. My name is David Edwards. Are you thirsty? I know I am. You know what? I want a drink that's perfect for the back deck, at a party, or sitting on the beach. That's right. Let's have some beach water. All right, it's great to have every single one of you back here today. It is the depth of winter, and you know what? I dream of beaches and the warm water surrounding them in the Caribbean, at a lake, whatever. It doesn't really matter because you know it's summer somewhere in the world, just not here today. So I have the perfect drink to take you out to the beach. It's called beach water. Simple, easy, and it's blue because who doesn't like a blue cocktail? So let's get into this. Grab your glass of choice. In my case, I'm doing a fancy stemless wine glass because I just think it'll look good and I don't have to worry about knocking it over because it doesn't have a stem, All right? This is a build in your glass cocktail. So you know what? Put the shakers away, the stirring spoons, put everything away that you don't need because it's gonna be easy. Grab some ice. All right. Now that that looks absolutely awesome, grab your coconut rum. In this case, I'm using Malibu coconut rum. It's what I have on the shelf. It was given to me by a friend of mine and one of our viewers, Dan, thank you very much. Depending on the strength of coconut that you like, adjust these levels. And for this, I'm going to use an ounce and a quarter. Oh, looks pretty. It does, it does. Oh yeah, just can't go wrong. The next thing you want is your vodka of choice. And in this case, I'm using Heretic Spirits. They are a local vodka company to me. Uh, they're about an hour west of where I live. And this is batch number five. And for those of you that are new to the channel, I like supporting my local brands. I'm a huge fan of thinking that we should buy local, especially with our, uh, our spirits. And of course, you know, if there's something specific you want, get it from wherever you need to. And for this, we need one and three quarter ounces, 52 and a half milliliters. And look at that. Absolutely crystal clear. You can't go wrong. I'm gonna move this over here. Grab your Sprite, your lemon lime soda of choice. I just happen to have Sprite, so that's what I'm going to use. And we're going to add a good three ounces or 90 milliliters. Bring it up to the desired level that you want. And now we go to the simplest and most interesting of liqueurs. We're gonna go for our blue curacao. Now I'm using McGinnis brand blue curacao. It's what I have locally to me. This is an orange liqueur and this is what'll give us our blue look. Flip your jigger over and we need about half an ounce to three quarters of an ounce, depending on your personal taste. I'm going to go with three quarters of an ounce, which is 22 and a half milliliters. And what you want to do is you just want to pour it over slowly. There you go. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. I am now taken directly to the beaches of the Caribbean with nice crystal blue water. Take your stirring spoon that I told you to put away. You don't have to do this. In fact, you know what? Better yet, get rid of this. Grab a bendy straw. Actually, a smaller bendy straw. Jam that in there and drink it from the bottom so you're gonna get a little bit of the alcohol first. And you know what? Give this a gentle stir because you got your straw. Let's give it a smell. Smells great. I have coconut directly on the nose, but it's not strong and it's not overpowering in its smell. I can get a little bit of orange and a little bit of this Sprite. Let's give it a try. Oh yeah, mm, that's good. The coconut comes through nice and clean. It's not overpowering. The It's well balanced with the cure cell to the lemon lime uh, Sprite. You know what I mean? Um, you could adjust these ratios any way you want to suit your needs. 
This, you know what, I don't need a straw. This is a back decker, a by the pool. While you're having friends over, it looks great, it tastes great. If you think I should use a different coconut rum, a different carousel and a different vodka, please leave it down in the comments below. If this is your first time to my channel, please hit the subscribe button and make sure you hit that bell notification. That way, every time I put up a new video, you will be notified. And if you'd like to help support the channel, please check us out at patreon.com forward slash booze on the rocks because every little bit helps us to keep bringing these videos to you. And you know what? I'm going back to the beach water. Oh, that's good. Shit, this is the first time I've ever done a video within one take. What the hell's wrong with me? Um, um, I, uh, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I don't know what to do that I didn't mess up. You have a great night. <laughs>